All right, seven star Charizard. It's about gone, and this thing has been beaten into the ground multiple times. However, today, today, we do the most ridiculous one shot strat I think we have ever done for a seven star raid. Okay, this tops the Cramorant uh, one shot strat, tops just about everything else because tonight. We one-shot 7-star Charizard with Igglybuff. That's right, not Jigglypuff, not Clefairy. Igglybuff. Absolutely ridiculous. So with that, let's get to it. Real quick, let's talk about this, okay? You guys just watched this happen, okay? Just watched this happen. This is DK Swole, the Iggly buff. There's no reason this should work, yet it does. So, it's normal fairy, normal terra type, focus sash, level 100, because it is a seven star raid. Max EVs in attack and speed, adamant nature, friend guard to reduce damage, play rough, and psych up. That's it, okay? Does Psych Up turn one on Magmar to get uh, Psych Up on Magmar turn one, so that way he gets the effects of Belly Drum, does nothing turn two, and then does play rough and one shots. Absolutely monstrous, ridiculous build that Nawabble Fett came up with on this one. Okay? Uh, so this paired with the Magmar, the Swampert, uh, and whoever else was in that raid, uh, Florgus. Yeah, it's it's absolutely insane. So this one absolutely nuts uh, has no business going into a raid. But yeah, uh, it's so good. We need to see it. So let's see what it looks like. All right, chat. So we've done a lot of Okos in the past. OK, we've done baby Okos. We've done ridiculous Okos. We've done Cramorant Okos. This one, though. This one probably takes the cake because this is one that has, honest to God, no business going into not only a Charizard raid, but any battle whatsoever. And the team that goes with it is absolutely ridiculous. Okay? So, I present to you the final Oko for 7-star Charizard, which is taking it down in one shot with... Igglybuff. That's right, Igglybuff. Not Jigglypuff, not Clefairy. Igglybuff, chat. <laughs> and this is going to be ridiculous. So the only thing that could make this fail is if Overheat hits Igglybuff, turn one, okay? That's it. All right, so here's how this works. With a minute left on the clock before the raid starts, turn one, Swampert does Screech on Charizard, Florgus does Attack Cheer, Magmar does Belly Drum, Igglybuff does Psych Up on Magmar, must wait until after Belly Drum goes off. Turn two, Swampert does Screech again, Florgus does Helping Hand on Igglybuff, Magmar does Scary Face, Igglybuff does nothing. Turn three, Squ Swampert does another Screech, Florg does, Florgus does nothing, Magmar does nothing, Igglybuff waits for everything to go off and then uses Play Rough. And if Charizard misses Igglybuff turn one, just spam Heal Cheer until it hits Igglybuff. Holy cow. All right. Let's do this. This is going to be the most insane strat ever if this works. Oh. God, this is going to be... Oh, this is going to be so ridiculous. You never thought, chat, you would see an Iggly buff that's about ready to copy a belly drum. We get all the setup and misplay rough. No, it's more you miss the three screeches more than anything. All right, so we wait. Overheat goes off. It does. It tanks Magmar, which is good. That means this can work. Okay. Charizard clears. I'm waiting. I'm going to use Psych Up uh, on Magmar after it does Belly Drum. Charizard does Huracan. I get hit down to one HP because of Focus Sash. 
Okay. Oh, the confusion! The confusion is rough! Don't hit yourself. Don't hit yourself. Oh, it does psych up. Holy crap, that's good. Okay, so Screech 2 goes off. Turn 2, Eagly Buff does nothing. Helping hand on me. Someone, for the love of God, needs to do an attack cheer or a heal cheer at some point because I'm not faster. Okay, uh, turn three, I just need to see one more Screech, is all I need to see. All I need to see is one more, oh, it's at minus six already. Okay, so that's good, Scary Face, Charizard, play rough. I sweat, snapped out of confusion, play rough. Oh my God, it works. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Even with Magmar getting KO'd, there's... <laughs> Wait, there's no way that worked. <laughs> of all the things that we have ever taken down a 7-star raid with, Iggly buff. That's... What the hell, man? <laughs> that was the best Oko we've ever done. Oh, dear Lord. No Herba Mystica on this one. No patch. But you know what? That was worth it. So, huge shout out to DeWobblefit for coming up with this one. Uh, because there were a lot of moving parts that went into this. A lot of moving parts, uh, especially for a raid that we never tested before we did it. So, and of course, thanks to Abik and Real Cosmic Chaos for hopping in on this one. Let me know down in the comments. What do you guys think? What's, yeah, it, I don't think it can get more ridiculous than this. And as always, make sure you hit the like button, consider subscribing, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!